Hi, and welcome to The Calendar. I'm your host, Chris Nation. Joining me as always is Crystal Shalee, our lifestyle editor here at Herald Mail. How are you doing today? Good, how are you? I'm doing good, and I'm excited. We have some good events this week, right? Don't we always? We always do, but <laughs> I'm a little particular to these. In fact, uh -huh. the first one's about dancing, right? Yes, I um, I used to do the, these line dancing classes. I got to the point where I was at line dancing like for a lifetime. I don't know if I could do it anymore. Ooh, um, yeah. But uh, so the Country Western Dance Association here in uh, Hagerstown, actually out halfway specifically, Specifically, they're going to be uh, they they're ha having classes at St. Joseph's Catholic Church. Now, um, this eight week session and it's five dollars for each lesson. I think that's a pretty good deal. Yeah. The thing about dan line dancing, people don't, they think of like line dancing in the traditional sense of like you know line, line dancing. Lines, yeah. But there's also um, you know there's these great couple dances, Ooh, okay. and there's there's like these these great dances where it's like group dancing. Um, so, you know, so it's, if you're not, you know, I was never coordinated to do the electric slide. Yeah, no, some of those were, I, I was never Like to this dancer, day, yeah. I cannot do it. Yeah, no. But I like the other types of line dancing, and it's a little bit of everything, and it'll be fun. Fun, fun, fun. Seems and what other, what, it's a Tuesday night, too. What else has you, you got better to do? Yeah, no kidding. If it's yeah. a Tuesday, you got nothing to do, you might as well go out exactly. and do some line dancing. Well, and great exercise. Very nice. Let's go ahead and tell them all about it. We'll get that info up on the screen for you. Now, that event is the Country Western Dance Association. It's hosting line dance lessons. That's 7 to 8 p.m. on Tuesday. St. Joseph's Catholic Church. It's in the corner of Virginia Avenue and Halfway Boulevard. Halfway eight-week sessions. That's $5 for each lesson. And the email is currently up on your screen. Now, for those who don't know me, I'm, I'm a huge book nerd. Uh, I read about two books a week. I, I love it. And you're telling me we've got an author coming, right? Yeah, Robert Saunders. Um, he is here locally. I think he's in West Virginia. Mm -hmm. I did a story with him eons ago in another lifetime. So <laughs> when I talked to him then, he was in West Virginia. But um, so he did this whole thing about Tommytown um, series. Mm -hmm. And now he's got a brand new book out. It's called The Liver Transplant Bruise. Ooh, that sounds good. So it's very intriguing. And, yeah. So let me, so this, uh, there's a reverend, Reverend Clark. Duvall, and he discovers there are deceitful, greedy doctors and who made millions of dollars by manipulating the liver transplant waiting list. Ooh, Not yeah. like that would ever happen today. Yeah, no, of course. No, no, no. never, never. So, uh, so he, this is basically a thriller. And what's better, I love, you know, like oh, medical thrillers. He's I mean, a page turner, and you're like, what's yeah, going to happen exactly. next? Okay, wait, no, he did it. No, he did it. So yeah. he, he has a lot of, low, he's been doing a lot of um, book signings here in the area, okay. but uh, you can, this one's particular is going to be at the Sharpsburg Library, and you can, you can search for him online, and he probably has a list of, if you miss him there, there's probably a bunch more other places you can meet him. He's a really friendly guy, you can uh, sit there and chat with him for a while, talk about writing and, re and uh, book writing, so. And plus, how often do you actually get to meet the author that wrote the book you're getting exactly. ready to read, and have him sign a copy of it? I mean, that, See, you that know, rarely happens. You know, I'm a published author, so. Yeah. It is, I fi just finished another book, which I'm getting ready to try to like nice. shop. Yeah. It is hard work, because it takes a, a long time, and you have to have dedication. The, the book that I finished personally myself, I started like 97. Oh, it takes and forever. Kept, yeah. And put it away, brought it back, put it away. He has been very prolific in his writing, uh, so that takes a lot of dedication. No kidding, you gotta yeah. love the craft. Yes. So if you wanna go out and get a copy of that book, let's get that info up for you on the screen. That's a book signing with Robert L. Sanders. It's 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. on Wednesday. That's at the Sharpsburg Library, 106 East Main Street in Sharpsburg. And the email, currently up on your screen. Now, maybe some people just aren't into books. That may be their thing, but they're more into plays and things like that. What do we have going on for them? Legally Blonde, which is probably one of my favorite brand new musicals. It's 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 only been out the last couple of years. People really know it from the the movie, the movie yeah. with Reese Witherspoon, and uh, what was her dog's name? Bruiser. Bruiser, that's yes, right. Bruiser. Yeah. So Elle Woods, um, she in this uh, musical, she you know is in love with her boyfriend who kind of breaks up with her, and he goes to law school, and she's going to prove him and follows him to law school, and ends up finding that she actually is pretty good at it. So. Therefore, uh, this is a great musical. Um, they've been doing it a lot around here in the tri-state area, and great, fun songs. Um, now, it is a little risque, so I don't know if you want to take young kids to it. Okay. Because so this, there this is, is sexual one, yeah. overtones to it. So this is one of those ones they should not take the children. Not to. young kids. Okay. Yeah. Leave like, the kids at home. Get yeah. A like sitter. maybe this is probably more PG-13. Okay. Think of the way the movie's rated. Rate rate the musical. So the if you let way. your kids see the movie, probably be okay at the musical. Yeah. Yeah. So you know, but it's fun, fun, fun. 
Seems like a great event. Yeah. Now, if you want to go check out Legally Blonde, the musical, let's get that info up on the screen for you. That way you can go. That is Legally Blonde, 7.30 p.m. Thursdays to 8 p.m. Fridays and Saturdays, just depending on which day. Those are your show times. 2.30 p.m. Sunday through, or Sunday through Sunday, September 15th. Old Opera House, 204 North Georgia, Charlestown, West Virginia. Tickets cost $15 to $19. $10 for students for all performances showing ID, phone number, as well as the website currently up on your screen. Now, the next event, I've gone to a couple of these. It's a phenomenal uh -huh. event, you know, especially if you have a long week and you've worked hard, you want to relax Friday. It's great, right? Well, you know, I am very bad because I, I have not been to a Wind Down Friday. You haven't been yet? Oh, no, I mean, since I've been here, and which is pretty sad. I, shame on me. Ah, but this there. is the band I really want to see because mm -hmm. I, I listen to them. They're, they're from Frederick. Um, they have this great, they remind me of Sister Hazel, if anybody remembers okay, them. Yeah, like they kind of remind yeah. me of that in that type of vein, that type of genre. Very poppy Americana is what I'm calling it. I don't know if that's a genre, but I just made it up. Very nice. Hey, we'll go with that, right? So we actually have a video of them singing Clementine. Very cool. Let's go ahead and take a look at that video. You're right. That's a great band. Yeah, I love the, what, what's their, what's their name? Carousel, the Carousel uh, Rogues. Very interesting name, yeah. too, right? Well, yeah, I had to think there. I wasn't. I couldn't read it for some reason. Ah, you nailed it. Yeah, you nailed yeah. it. Let's get that info up for them, though. That way, if they want to go and they haven't gone to one, they still can. Now, what you're seeing up on your screen is that info. That's Wind Down Friday. That's, of course, at the Carousel Rogues will perform. That's 5.30 p.m. Doors open. 6 p.m. Music, the Maryland Theater. 21 South Potomac Street. It's downtown Hagerstown. $5 and $2, ages 12 and younger. The number's up on your screen. And see, so you weren't the only one that struggled with that name. I right know. It's now, just right? like you look at it and you're like, oh, we're, we're all, we're, I don't know. Sorry. So the next one's really patriotic, right? Well, we've talked about this before. Yeah. It's the Red, White, and Blue uh, concert series. Oh, yeah. So, um, you know, it's it's great the U.S. Air Force concert band will perform. There's going to be uh, the World Classic Symphonic Wind Ensemble. Um, there's a lot of events that they perform at. And this is great because, you know, if you want to see all type of popular events, classicals, they do it all. Very They're cool. The best, the best. We'll talk a little bit more about that coming back in just a minute. Stick around. We have more events coming up for you.